Guys, it's Wesley. I'll show you all the dagger. I think I've showed it before. Let's show it one more time. Try to make sure I go over everything. It's built by Platinum. It's a three bedroom, two bath. It's got a bonus room. Um, steer vinyl. It's got some board and bat vinyl over here. It's got some, a stone accent on the bottom here. It goes around the door. So on the outside right now, it's just light set. So a lot of times on the light, we don't set everything up, but it's gonna have a light there and it'll have a light on the other side. This has got the Craftsman type door. I think that's the name style they're calling that door, Craftsman. It's got the uh, storm door on it. Take a look on the inside. Come into the living room. Just get the place for the TV. Goes right there. Pretty big open concept. Dining area, kitchen down there. Bonus room over here. We'll go down to the kitchen. Got beams in the ceiling, LED lights. Vinyl hood, I don't think that's the European style. I think the European style is supposed to have the glass, but I'm not 100% on it. Wood cabinets. A good number of cabinets. Got the stainless steel package in it. Long bar. I think the bar's 10 and a half foot. Glass top stove, rounded countertops, and they've got a, a, a ceramic tile backsplash on it. It's got linoleum floor in the living room. Looks like it goes down the hall into the guest bedrooms. I'm gonna assume the guest bedrooms are carpet and the same for the master. Stainless steel. Bridge. One of my favorite things about platinum, each house has got something I like in it. But this one, that's all the rubber bands that come with it. But in this one, they got the big pot and pan drawers. On the side of the platinum drawers, they're gonna be metal. The fronts are wood, the side is metal. You're gonna have a pressed wood type of back. That happens, that's in a lot of cabinets. I don't know any cabinets that are full of wood. Uh, a lot of times, it's just gonna be your fronts. The salon's got places to set bar stools. And you've got that seating area over there. Look over here into the laundry room. Door, it's stylish door. It's made like that so that it can pull air through it. Still looks good. It doesn't have to have that big vent in it, but it pulls air through there to your return air. Return air is right there. It's your laundry room. It's place where washer dryer goes. Yeah, you can cut the whole house. Like if you had a leak somewhere in the house, you cut it off right here. Cuts water off to the whole house. Mop sink, back door here. Cabinets. And behind me, behind the door here. I know it's hard with the lighting. But it's uh, like a place where you can sit down, take shoes off, hang coats up. Stuff like that. Kind of like a little locker there. Right off the back door. That's how the missed up. Second ago, it's got the built-in microwave. Just space saver. Some of them have the microwave in a hood. This one's just got a vent a hood and a built-in microwave right here. Four big windows there. Let in a lot of light. It'd be pretty on a lake or something. Back down here is the living room. Over here where the TV goes, it's got two lights on the side of it. Some ship light behind it. Little rock accent. I'm sure. Move some of this out of the way. See down in there. But it's already wired for the TV. And it's, it's got power for the TV and it's got a like a place where you run your, it's got a conduit and stuff in there where you just run your wire through there. Master bedroom. Good size master bedroom. Master bath. Double sinks. Again, the wood cabinets even in the bathroom. Trimmed up mirror there. Place for towels and stuff right here. Big area for the tub, big circle tub. Pretty neat. You got a ceramic tile around it and then some rock accent added into it. That's the same thing over here in the shower. Guys, I'm sorry. 
the light and big closet. You can't see anything, it just looks dark. But it's got wood wood racks and two racks over there for shoes. Let's go take a look at these guest bedrooms and this bonus room. So off the living room is this bonus room. You're gonna have two barn doors right there. It's got a locker type thing in here. This could be used as another bedroom if you wanna make this full bedroom home. Just shoot rock off one of those. Just make it a regular door. Turn that area into a closet. Here in the hallway, it's got another desk area. So power there and then you get power below and another raceway is what they call it. So it's a pipe that goes out below the home where you'd be able to run whatever cables you needed through it. It's got some shelving above it. It's the guest bath. Really good guest bath. Hard to film it. It's got the oversized tub. And above it, it's gonna have a window to let in some light. You know this light's not very good, but there's a there's three cabinets there that's got some places to put towels. First guest bedroom. Both bedrooms are the same size. This is the probably the smallest, this is the smallest closet in the home. Small, it's not too small. Take a look. This other bedroom is gonna have the best, we put all the trim out for you on it. This bedroom here has got the best closet. Step across the stuff. It's a really big walk-in closet. It's almost as big as the master closet. I said that Max calls about twice as big as that. It's a big call, especially for a guest bedroom. And it does have carpet in the bedrooms. You're gonna have a transition piece there where the lino comes together. This home has not been trimmed out yet. Guys, I appreciate y'all watching. If you got any other questions, suggestions, you wanna see another house, I think I got some on the lot or wanna know if I know have one on the lot, leave it in the comments and I'll get back to you. Thank you.